So we're about uh, nine miles away from Selby in Yorkshire. Up to Selby Power Station, you can probably see the, one of the funnels right, right in the distance. Steam coming out of it. Uh, we're about f f three or four miles from uh, Selby. It's a beautiful day. I haven't got enough breath to speak. We're nearly in Ghoul though. It's been a great ride, beautiful weather. Let's see how we go. We've got two or two miles away from the hotel. Boy, I'll sleep well tonight. So we're heading out of Ghoul now, heading towards Hull. Roads are a bit busy, it's very bright, but um, surprisingly cool. Ideal cycling weather, really. We've totally got our sun, sun lotion on though. Beautiful sight everywhere. So there's my lovely wifey, ah. <laughs> and yeah, this is the trail that we're on at the moment, and you can see the fields, and in the distance you can see a wind farm with everything just stationary. Let's just zoom in. I don't often see that. It's very warm, but there's a really good breeze, so it's keeping us cool. A bit worried about sunburn now. <laughs> Very cool. And of course, Katya's keeping up like a Trojan, like a soldier behind. Looks very sweet. So, so is the wife, of course. <laughs> but yeah, this is the River Ruse, I think, isn't it? And that's where we're headed. Well, this is one of the rougher tracks. Hopefully the camera will still be able to steady it, but God, it's tough to ride. It's not the worst one we've been on, but it's still pretty rough. We've got a couple of miles of this yet. And then we're gonna to get to a water park, which will be nice, cooling anyway. Absolutely terrific countryside. Just beautiful. A lot of kids messing around, but there's Katya in the distance.
So this is Swanland, which is uh, just slightly off the Pennine Trail. The roads are much better this particular way, the other one would have been on dirt tracks. And it's nearly 30 degrees so we just wanted to take it easy a bit, but that is, this is so beautiful. So we're in Hull and we're just setting off now for Hornsey <laughs> and uh, we're in a park. This apparently is the start of the um, Hornsey Trail. Heading out of Hull. It's very hot but very breezy too so it's keeping the uh, temperature down. We're actually at our coolest while we're cycling uphill would you believe. It's really great. This isn't the Humber Bridge by the way, I don't know what it is. Fun though. And there's Katya, having a good time. <laughs> Give us a wave, darling. <laughs> so quiet. Nothing but the noise of nature and electric bike battery motors. the end of our journey. Actually no it isn't, we're going to Bridgend now. But this is the whole seafront at Hornsey, all deep blue sea, the other side of the country. Very cool.
So now we're on the road to Brindleton. It's not much fun, but you can see Katya behind. There's quite a lot of uphill sections. So hopefully our batteries have been fully charged in the pub. I'm still on the road to Bridlington, it's a bit scarier, especially when you're photographing with one hand. But still beautiful countryside. And we're here at our final destination. We're at the Ransdale bed and breakfast. And then just down the road is the sea. Look at us. So we're on Bridlington uh, Beach and it's a really lovely day. It's just perfect for going in the sea and that's what Katya's doing. She's right in the middle of the picture just walking. She's just getting to the sea to decide whether it's worth going for a swim because the, the water temperature is only like 17 degrees centigrade so it might be a bit too cold but it's very beautiful around. There she is. Shall I or shan't I, she's thinking. Hmm, is it cold or is it too warm? Still thinking. Yep, she's going for it. Knew she would. It's <laughs> <laughs> 